Hello everyone, welcome back to TechLogix, your go-to for easy CCTV setups. Struggling to get your new Prima STQC approved IP cameras online? No problem. Today, we're diving into the Prima ODDT tool, a free, powerful utility to search, activate, and configure IP addresses for your Prima network devices. It's like Hikvision's SADP tool on steroids, but built just for Prima. If you're a beginner installer or a pro troubleshooting, this step-by-step -step guide will save you hours. Stick around, we'll cover downloading, installing, activating, and setting up IPs. Hit that like button if you're ready, and let's jump in. Quick note, Hikvision's SADP tool only detects Hikvision devices and won't find Prima STQC cameras because of their unique firmware. That's why you need the Prima ODDT tool to search, activate, and configure Prima devices. Let's get started with ODDT. Alright, let's grab the Prima ODDT tool. It's completely free and safe, but to avoid sketchy downloads, we recommend getting it directly from the official Prima India website, Pramandia. In. For your convenience, we've also linked a trusted direct download from a verified source in the video description below. Click that link to download the ODDT setup file, it's a quick 65 megabytes file. Once it's downloaded, you're ready to install, so let's walk through it step by step. Got the file? Awesome! First, find the ODDT. EXE file in your downloads folder, right-click it, and select Run as Administrator, this is crucial to avoid permission issues. When the setup wizard pops up, you might see a Windows security prompt. No worries, just click More Info, then hit Run anyway to start the installation. This can happen with new software, but you're good to go with our verified file. Now, accept the terms and conditions, just check the box. You can stick with the default install path or choose your own if you're feeling fancy. Keep clicking next to move through the prompts, it's super straightforward. The wizard guides you every step, so you can't mess this up. Hit that install button. The installation takes about 30 seconds. Once it's done, you'll see a final screen with a checkbox for launch ODDT, make sure it's checked, then hit finish. Boom, the ODDT tool opens, and you're in. The interface is clean and ready, with a device list on the left and all the tools you need to search and configure your Prima CCTV devices. The Prima ODDT tool can now detect all Prima cameras, including STQC approved ones, and they'll show up right away on the device list. This makes managing your Prima CCTV devices quick and easy every day. Got a new Prima device? It's going to show as inactive until you activate it. Think of it like unlocking your camera with a password. It's a simple step to get it ready to roll. Here's how you do it. In the ODDT tool, click the inactive device in the list, and its details will pop up on the right. Type in a strong password, at least 8 characters, mixing letters, numbers, and symbols. Hit submit, and in 5 to 10 seconds, you'll get a green device activated message. Boom, your camera's unlocked and good to go. After setting your password in the ODDT tool, you'll get a prompt to add security questions for password recovery. This is super handy if you ever forget your password, letting you reset it yourself without any hassle. You can pick questions like, what's your favorite camera model? Or what's your pet's name? And set your answers. It takes just a minute to set up and could save you a ton of trouble later. If you're in a rush or don't want to bother, no worries, you can skip this step and still activate your device. It's totally your choice. Now that your Prima camera or NVR is activated, let's set its IP address to keep things rock solid. Using a static IP is awesome because it stops the device's IP from changing every time your router or modem reboots, unlike DHCP, which can shuffle IPs around. Start by selecting your activated device in the ODDT tool and clicking the Modify IP or Network Settings tab. You'll see two options, DHCP for automatic IPs, great for simple home setups, or static for a fixed IP, perfect for pro installs where you want total control. If you choose static, uncheck the DHCP option and enter the details, set an IP like 192.168.1.101, 
subnet mask is 255.255.255.0, gateway as your router's IP, usually 192.168.1.1, and DNS as 8.8.8.8 for Google server. Double check those numbers to avoid conflicts on your network. Hit apply, and the device will reboot. In a few seconds, the new IP shows up in the ODDT list. Done. Your camera or NVR now has a stable address, no matter how many times your router restarts. Now that your Prima camera's IP is set, you can access it right from your web browser. Just open your browser and type the camera's IP address, like 192.168.1.101, into the URL bar, then hit enter. It's that simple to reach the camera's web interface. If you see a security warning pop up, don't panic. Click Advanced, then select Proceed to the IP address. This happens with some cameras on local networks, but you're safe to move forward. Once the login page loads, use Admin as the username and enter the password you created earlier during activation. Hit Login, and you're in. You can now tweak settings, view live feeds, or manage your Prima camera like a pro. Awesome, now that you're logged into your Prima camera's web interface, let's level up your setup. In this next part, we'll show you how to install the web plugin for smooth live feeds, then dive into a quick firmware update using the ODDT tool. After that, we'll enable OnVIF integration to connect your Prima camera to third-party NVRs or apps. These steps unlock pro features like better video quality, remote access, and seamless compatibility. If you found this video helpful, we'd really appreciate your support. Please like the video, share it with others, or subscribe to our channel. Your engagement helps us create more awesome content for you. Thank you for being part of the TechLogix community.